Hi there, Linda Goodall here. In this quick video, we'll focus on spacing in Hatch lettering. Hatch has an easy way to control letter spacing using the letter spacing in the advanced section of the lettering docker. So if I select this text and change this to say 0.7, you can see how they get squished together. Here I have text on an arc. It works the same here, 0.5. And now we've squished those up a little bit. If you need to adjust spacing between some letters, say I want to move these two E's in closer, or I think that R is a little too far, I can select the text, click reshape, and now if I just select these little diamonds, if I click on those little diamonds, see how I can move my letters. Now we don't have an option for word spacing. So what if you need to move a whole word? Well, that's easy. Right click where you want to start your move. Notice that all my diamonds now in this word are blue, and so I can just move them that way. To move this word, I'll just drag a selection and move that in like that. Same thing works up here. And notice how all the words slide on the baseline. So even if I jiggle around my mouse, they're still sliding on the baseline. That's the great thing about doing it this way. Now let's undo this. And if you were to break apart, see there's my text, it's one line, and I'll do break apart, control K. Now I have three words. Now if I try to move these closer, notice how my arc changes, because I don't really have an arc anymore. I just have these three words. Plus, if I would need to edit that, say change it to 135 or whatever, I would need to do each word and not the whole text block. So you can do quite a bit with text without having to do break apart once you know a few tricks like this. Thanks for watching and please like and subscribe and please leave a comment. Bye.